Hi friends, welcome back. In today's section, we are going to learn how to merge two tables in Excel. Let's see. We have daily sales quantity table. Another is product master with sales prices. Before starting our section, we have to ensure that our data should be in table format. For this, press Ctrl L. It will convert this data into table format. Press OK. Remove banded rows. Perfect. And here change the name as sales. OK. Now go to the product master. Press Ctrl L. OK. Banded rows. And table name is master. Press enter. Perfect. Now click on data from table. Here we are going to use our query editor. Now change the date format into date. Perfect. Click on close and load to. Here we are going to create a connection only. So click on only create connection. Load. So our first connection created. Now do the same thing in product master. In data menu, press from table. And then everything is perfect. So click close and load to. This screen is also create connection. Perfect. Now we are going to create a new table. It's merging these two tables. For this, click on new query, combine queries and merge. Click sales table and click master table. Here our unique columns are product name. Click on both tables. Perfect. So no errors. Click OK. Now our second table data is clipped in this column, in this icon. Click here. So product name is already there. So again, no need to select that column. We will remove it and untick this column. Press OK. So here, selling price came from the master table. Now we are going to add a new column. Press add column, custom column, sales value or we can also give a column name as total sale value for particular product. Here we are going to multiply quantity with selling price. Perfect. No syntax errors. Press OK. So you can check the formula from here. Now in the new table, we don't require these two columns. So we are going to remove these two columns. Click on remove columns. Perfect. Here, change the name. Um, Total sales. Press enter. Perfect. Now click on close and load to. Here we no need to select the connection. 
we are going to create table only perfect yes so in the main sheet user enters only the product name and quantity in master file we get the product name and total sale value suppose if i enter any new date then file in master file if i refresh this table the new figure will come you can click this icon also to refresh the table see here on 11th pi cpu on 11th pi cpu value is 20000 perfect if you want to add the total for this column then right click click on table total rows perfect if you have any doubts or queries as always you can use the comment box thank you thank you for watching this video